guys, now that's my awesome. So I thought I might do a different intro for you guys. I'm really just going to talk about how I feel about going to school and about all that stuff today. So I'm thinking I might start off with the basics. How I'm feeling to go. So I'm feeling how I might go since I'm a little bit younger for fifth grade, but not really that old for fifth grade. I'm thinking I might be a little bit nervous, a little bit shaky to meet my new teachers and my new friends. So that's what I'm thinking. Now I'm gonna talk about the rules that might be going on in fifth grade they might change from summer school even though i'm not in summer school they might change because in summer school they're thinking to put up um those big things that you see when you go to the drive-ins at mcdonald's burger king and all those restaurants and all that stuff so they were thinking about it, but they thought it might be too harsh. So they turned it down a notch to just mask and gloves, I'm thinking. Um, but gloves are kind of like a advantage because they give you more grip. Um, but it's also a disadvantage because they'll, you'll get more distracted from all the noises. Now just add that when I snap. Boom. See it just. No. And you don't get to be with your class. So that's kind of, Well you get to be with your class. But not with other classes. So that's kind of upsetting. For me and maybe other people. I might. Not go. Or I might go because my dad thinks, no, these are too, they're not bad rules, but I didn't want him to go in summer school. And usually he puts me in summer school, so I'm not thinking I might go in fifth grade. So it's a 50-50 because I didn't get to go in summer school. So let's talk about the rules. So I already talked about a few things. Um, mask, you have to have them. No mask, you can't. So only one class per recess and one class per lunch. Or maybe they might have two for one end and the other end of the cafeteria. They might do that. Um, who knows, but even in your class, you have to stay six feet away. So that's kind of horrible. Because if six feet is almost, it's longer than me, but kind of short. So, I'm not sure how I'm going to go through that. So I'm a little bit nervous because all this corona. So, use mask at all times. Besides the cafeteria, they might have you have it gone like this, where you can still do it, or have it up where it just does this and you can still eat, not breathe. You can breathe through your nose, but not really. So, it's going to be a little bit difficult. And... For other rules, I'm not really sure what the other rules are, but for, hmm, let me think about it for a second. Oh yeah, how it's going to react for all my actions, it might be a little bit hard on me because... If you think about it, six feet away, mask on at all times. Really, don't touch a, 
equipment. Stay on blacktop. Can't play soccer. Can't play football. You can't even play shadow tag, really. Because even though shadow tag is not touching people, that's less than six feet away. So you can't really play anything. You can only run around. Or sit. So that's going to be hard and difficult. But if they change their minds, I think it might be a good choice for me to go there. Because if it happens again, which actually is not really that hard. As you've seen, other people got twice in a row. But I'm not really sure how it's going to react to all of us. It's really just going to be hard, difficult, and really, I don't know. So, I'm just a little bit going to be shy and nervous. So, what are your thoughts? Do you think they should go to school or should not? I'm thinking 50-50 because their parent shy. A little bit nervous for their kids for because all the corona and all that stuff is happening with other people. So I'm 50-50 because some people might be um, a little bit more rich. So if they get sick, they can go to the hospital and cure them. Maybe. So it's a 50-50. Maybe not. Maybe so. Who knows? But what are your thoughts? Leave them down in the comments. Make sure to like this video, subscribe. As always, my Nana is going to leave something in the description. So check out my other video. It's gonna be like right here. Um, peace out. Hope you enjoyed and watch the next video. Peace. the ghost in here um no my nan just moved the camera